isomerism isomerism is the phenomenon in which more than one compounds have the same chemical formula but different chemical structures but chemical compounds that have identical chemical formula but differ in properties are called isomers let us take few examples to understand the concept of isomerism so here we have one formula that is c2h5oh that means in this formula we have two carbon atoms six hydrogen atoms and one oxygen atom see the first example so here we have the structural formula ch3 ch2oh observe carefully in this structure also we have two carbon atoms same as in the structure six hydrogens that means three plus two plus one six hydrogens here also we have the same six hydrogens and one oxygen atom that means the c2h5oh has been written like this so two carbon atoms six hydrogens and one oxygen so this is called as ethanol same chemical formula has been written like this also ch3 bond o bond ch3 in this structural formula also there are two carbon atoms six hydrogens and one oxygen so observe carefully in both the structures the number of carbon atoms number of hydrogens number of oxygens are same that means the chemical formula is same but the structures are different so that's why these two are different compounds and these two have different chemical properties this is ethanol and this is dimethyl ether so this is called isomerism and these two are called as isomers let us take one more example that is c3h7cl that means three carbon atoms seven hydrogens and one chlorine atom see the example here the first one ch3 ch2 ch2 cl so in this structure also we have three carbon atoms same as the given structure see the hydrogens <coughs> three plus two plus two total seven hydrogens here also we have seven hydrogens and a chlorine chlorine is placed at the uh, last carbon of this structure so this structure is called as one chloropropane because the chlorine is attached to, to the first carbon atom so its name will be one chloropropane observe the second example ch3 ch uh, chlorine atom has been attached to the second carbon atom see observe number of carbons also three same as the given structure hydrogens three plus one plus three that means same seven hydrogens we have and one chlorine atom see this is two chloropropane in these two structures the number of carbons number of hydrogens and chlorines are same but the they are different chemical compounds having same molecular formula but different chemical structures so this is called isomerism and these two are called isomers isomers see one more example here we have the chemical formula of pentane c5 h12 c c5 h12 can be arranged in three types the first one is n pentane that is ch3 ch2 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 ch3 so this is called n pentane so in the first structural formula we have five carbons and 12 hydrogens this is also c5h12 but this structure is called as n pentane 
the same c5 h12 is also arranged like this this is that means one methyl group is attached to the second carbon count the number of carbons same five we have and hydrogens same 12 we have here also so but this is 2 methyl butane observe the third example so here also we have 5 carbon atoms and 12 hydrogens so this is for the second carbon there are 2 methyl groups attached so this is called as 2 2 dimethyl propane see in all these three structures the chemical formula is same c5h12 but the structures are different so this is called the phenomenon of isomerism and all these three are called isomers so having same chemical formula but different structures this phenomenon is called isomerism i hope you understand this Thank you.